Hello everyone and welcome to an, another tutorial video from me, Vusa. If you haven't done it already, be sure to like this video and also subscribe to the channel and let me know down in the comments what you think about Ruler Designer in Crusader Kings 3. Today I will show you how to find the Ruler Designer. It, it was updated today actually, on the 24th of November. And I will show you how you will find the ruler designer and how you can create your own designer and <laughs> your own ruler with the designer in Crusader Kings 3. So first, you, what, what you want to do is to click new game. And here you can choose uh, when, do you, when do you, you want to start, oh, what age. Um, then you will see down here, play as any ruler in 1867 or create your own and uh, the timestamp will change depending on uh, which starting age you choose from here so let's choose 1867 so we click here and uh, here we come to the loading screen so then we will see the entire world uh, we are not yet seeing any option to uh, to, to make our own ruler we see it's a uh, it's gray so uh, let's go to finland and uh, we pick new Zealand. and now this is not grayed out anymore and now we can uh, for example go here enable iron man and create your own ruler and now here we will see a half naked man and we can start customizing and uh, down here you see achievements available. Achievements are available in Iron Man when you have not used more than 400 points. And to make this a little bit better experience for you, I will take off my camera. Boom. So here you will see a ruler designer. We can choose uh, gender, uh, male, female. We can also uh, randomize uh, what kind of sexual orientation, hetero, hetero homosexual bisexual asexual and we can uh, also be the same as male and um, here we can see which fate fin uh, uh, greek we can uh, choose fate and we can it's a uh, drop down uh, menus if there is like m multiple fates under the same uh, category and if you know Ugric, we will, uh, we will find Okonosuka. So that's uh, how that works. And uh, then you can pr uh, press cancel. You can also just write down uh, a name or just randomize. If you want to know, uh, randomized name. Uh, here we will get a randomized finished name. But we can also go to, uh, he is uh, Chinese and Han. And now we randomized name. We will uh, get a randomized Chinese name. So if you choose culture, and then you can randomize a, a lore friendly name for your character. Here we can also randomize uh, dynasty name. And uh, it's also based on which uh, culture you did choose. And down here, we can also uh, randomize coat of arms and reset title coat of arms. So we get the original one. Uh, up to the left, no, <laughs> up to the right, you will see customization points. So achievement limit is 400. We basically we have here 133. What could you do to get more points? Uh, you can adjust which age you are. For example, if you start at the age of uh, zero, you have only used 66 points. You can uh, also lower like diplomacy and everything, and you will get more points to use. Uh, you can also make yourself super old. For example, I am a hundred years and uh, and twenty, and you will get some crazy points. And um, when you have this many points, you could actually see how long you can live. 
by picking on as many benefits as possible. So I dare you to do this challenge. Put yourself as 120 years old and see how long you can rule by picking the best bonuses available. And uh, let me know what you did. So now we can uh, max out diplomacy. Quite a lot. So we can go how much we want. But uh, if uh, we want to be able to get achievements, we're 120 years old with uh, 45 diplomacy. So this would be a playable character if we still want to do achievements. But now we don't because it says we have above 400. So I think you can have a lot of uh, fun here. You can uh, also make yourself uh, really thin. You can also choose uh, to be a female. So that's that. You can also uh, make yourself a little bit more beautiful. I will put a reasonable years and weight, and we can uh, click on change appearance. Oh, before we do that, uh, um, you can also add traits and everything like Blade Master, Shimmer, Possessed, and we will also say uh, how many points, like uh, Family hier Hierarch, it uh, plus 50. But then you can also go to even things out. Um, we are also hideous, but we're a perfect diplomat. So you can give yourself a lot of drawbacks as well. But then by adjusting uh, these different attributes, uh, you can uh, get a nice character. It could also be married. Uh, you have uh, seven sons, one daughter. <laughs> You can have a maximum of eight children. And as you can see, uh, we have used way above 400 points right now. Mm. I wish that I could just uh, click here in the middle and then write zero. If I know from the start how many points I want in everything. Instead of uh, just uh, click uh, clicking a lot of times on plus and minus, I would love to just be able to click in the middle and put down a number. Uh, we can also um, make ourselves some nice, oh yeah, let's take, oh, take away that one. That's pretty nice. Uh, if we, um, I just noticed it. If we put like stuff like this, we're beautiful. They're changing appearance. That is a really nice touch. So and there is something you can uh, uh, fool around with. Oh yeah, let's make it make it dwarf. So here we can choose uh, ethnicity: West African, Arabic, Asian, West Central European, Northern, Arctic. And uh, when we when we pick something we are happy with, we can uh, customize further. Oh yeah, you can also copy DNA. Store DNA information in the clipboard and paste it into another character. So that's something that you might have use of later on. So um, when you have it in your clipboard, uh, you, you can later paste it in. But yeah, uh, here you can uh, choose body type. Low, body fat, medium, full, bust size, uh, skin color. You can also choose height. Um, and uh, here you can choose uh, which part of the body you want to adjust. Uh, you can't rotate, but you get like uh, uh, up front and from the side. And uh, you can adjust uh, the height. <laughs> uh, I think you can have a, a lot of fun creating nice characters. So, yeah. 
I hope you guys want to marry this character because it's a beauty. And uh, here we have a complex types that we can choose from as well. And uh, then we have ears. We can ear angle. Uh, also, how bendy will the ears be? Upper bend, lower bend. Inner, uh, also, the inner shape of the ear is uh, adjustable. Outward. <laughs> this is quite fun. And also the size of the ear. And um, the facial structure is actually quite uh, complex. Uh, chic fat. A lot. <laughs> Sorry, I wonder who will break this the first. Oh yeah, this is beautiful. I don't know why, I'm starting to think about Tyrion Lannister. Hmm. Dimples, yeah, not much. There's one dimple over there. Uh, and shin forward. Oh, yeah. Shin height. Oh, yeah. We will have a huge shin. <laughs> Look at this. Hmm. Pointy, pointy shin. Forehead. Uh, as you can see, there is many more we could uh, um, adjust with. I will adjust to. Uh, on random <laughs> oh god this is gorgeous <laughs> look at this hello honey what you doing <laughs> So I, I think you all can have a lot of uh, fun with, with this. I had to take a take a picture. You can also adjust uh, the eyes, eye corner depth, eye depth. Size of the eyes. The eyelids. And let's see. Hmm. Yeah, I think this is nice. Hello. <laughs> oh, look at all these options for, for nose as well. He is so grotesque. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I wonder if she will get married. I really hope she will. And also, as you can see, there is a, a lot uh, to, uh, to adjust the mouth. But I think you can have a lot of uh, fun creating beautiful or hideous characters. And I think you will get the basics. And of course, we want to have <laughs> a nice... Mm, hairstyle as well and uh, I do like curls <laughs> and this is beautiful I think this is uh, another masterpiece oh yeah I, I think uh, this is our character so yeah uh, if you 
if you liked this video and uh, you want to know more about uh, Crusader Kings, uh, let me know. Uh, I have made uh, multiple uh, uh, tutorials for Crusader Kings 3 and uh, I'm ha more than happy to answer questions. You can also catch uh, my live streams over Twitch. So yeah, if you haven't done it already, leave a like to the video. Also, uh, subscribe to channel if you, you had fun. I had uh, a lot of giggles. And uh, yeah, see you around. Uh, let me know what you think about the ruler designer for Crusader Kings 3. Thank you for watching. My name is uh, Wooza. And it was nice meeting you. Thank you and bye bye.